What up, my beautiful peoples? Welcome to another episode of Rizzy Talks. And today we're gonna to be talking about my first ever 92 hour fast and the details on me and my wife's daily 24 split. Let's go. What are we talking about? You're supposed to start it. I'm just trying to get, oh, um. Rubber bubble double bumpers. <laughs> Gooby Bubble gonna tell you about her bubble koopy and how she did her thubble thumper thumpy thump. You wanna go ahead and tell him that? All right, let's hop right into it. First, I'm gonna start off with the details of our daily fast. Me and my wife both do a 24 split. What that basically is, is we do 20 hours of fasting, and that's just basically water, no coffee, no tea, just straight water that we drink throughout the day. And we have a four hour uh, window where we both eat our first meal. We try to make it as nutritionist as possible. Do eat whatever we want to eat after that. But it's only a four hour window, so we don't get a lot of food in but it's been working very good for us. Um, for the first week, let me know. Okay, I wanna, okay. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me let my wife tell you about uh, how she felt for the first week and pretty much what she's going through. Go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. So I started last Tuesday. Um, I do work overnight shifts, so it's hard being at work and not eating, but I have fought through it um, it is tough at times because you do feel like you just want to eat. Um, I know right now I would love to go and get some breakfast, but I know I'm fasting because it's beneficial, not only to help me lose weight, wait, 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 but wait, wait, wait. Also Sorry life. to cut you off. I apologize for cutting you off. But do you honestly feel hungry or you just want something because we're both out in the morning something. time? Now see that, there's a difference between being hungry and just wanting something. But go ahead, I'm sorry about that. I just wanted to clarify that a little bit. Are you thirsty? Cause I know I get thirsty a lot. Oh yeah, I get thirsty like crazy. So when I'm at work, I'm in a gown um, a lot of times and I, as soon as I get out, I can drink an entire 24 ounces because I get so thirsty while I'm in there. Do you drink more water than what you usually do? No, I think I'm drinking about the same that I usually have because I've always drunk a lot of water. Do you get thirsty? Um, I just thirsty? get thirsty more. A lot thirsty more. Um, Do you get a lot of pains in your stomach? Not really. Um, I know when I, I know that, I know this is gonna sound crazy, but I know because I've been eating a lot different, I really haven't had to use the bathroom that much because it's just being absorbed, the nutrition of the food. As far food. as pooping? Yeah. Well, I'm peeing, I'm constantly going. It's just very weird. But have you gotten any headaches? Um, no, no headaches. Have you? How is, have your attitude? How you how you feel towards? I your... can get a little snippy at times, but that's probably from lack of sleep, not not eating. So. And you started off weighing how much? I when I went to the doctor's last Monday, I was two seventy one two seventy three point five. As you guys can see right here, this is everything. Uh, that my doctor, I mean my wife, this is how much my wife weighed, this is uh, you know how much uh, fat, how much muscle, how much water, what she started with. Um, after the first week, how much do you weigh now? I want to say I'm 260, but I'm not 100% sure because our scale is, the numbers are missing, like the partial numbers. So I believe it's 260, believe more it's likely. 260, but I can't swear to it. More likely it is, we're gonna go get weighed uh, on another scale, but should be 260, that's what it looks like, that's what I believe it is, only a portion is missing, uh, I can't think there's no other number where it's missing. Um, let me go off for me, I um, uh, started last, uh, I started on a Sunday, Sunday night at seven o'clock, um, and I got weighed in on a Thursday. I was 
the scale that I that I originally weighed myself on, I was a uh, 352, and when I got weighed in that Thursday, I was as you guys can see right here. This is how much I weighed when I got weighed in on Thursday. Now, I haven't been back to that to that particular scale, but that's from you know from the doctors. So from the scale that I weighed in at 352, I went and weighed myself, and it did match that number. And I weighed in our hours at our house, numbers didn't match. Um, for me, I felt good. The first day I was trying to do 20 hours. And I accidentally did 24 hours straight without even bothering me at all. I did get cold chills on like my second day with a slight headache. Um, but that's one of the things you're gonna go through that some people go through when your body's changing. After that, it was completely fine. I do get extremely thirsty. My mouth get dry all the time. And I find myself brushing my teeth more times during the day than what I normally do. I always do, you know, in the morning, but I have done it two or three times in a day because I believe my breath has been more smelly now that I'm fasting, believe it or not. It feels like I get, I get like a white tongue, I don't know. But I get extremely thirsty. I have been drinking a lot. Have been pooping much at all. Uh, my pee is still coming out yellow, but from the research I have done, that's all the toxins coming out of my body because I have never eaten correctly I, I mean it's my first time eating vegetables uh i've been away from greasy foods i mean it's 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 it's, it's a pretty a, a strong change my energy level has been tip top i have had more energy have you had more energy too a little bit yeah like i'm actually able to stay up i haven't i haven't been asleep since i worked last night and i woke up yesterday at two 45 because I had to go get kids from school and I haven't been back to sleep since and yesterday I got maybe five hours of sleep I will say that you don't complain that you're tired a lot anymore no you're more awake that. yeah more alert I would say my focus have gotten a lot a lot better um I've only been my wife only been getting about four or five hours of sleep um if that um I'm getting about a good five hours of sleep and my energy level has just been through the roof. Now, I started on Friday for my 96, for those of y'all that's, that's watching this for the long, for my long, prolonged fast. I did my uh, 24 split up until Friday. Friday at 11 p.m. I did not eat any more until Tuesday at 7 p.m. which made it 92 hours straight. Now, during that time, I was not tired. I did not feel hungry. I had no hunger pains at all, which blows my mind because like I'm a huge eater and love food and I haven't even felt a bit of hungry. I get thirsty like crazy. I mean, I do get thirsty like crazy that first 24 hours when I went to that 48 hour mark my energy level like took a spike where I felt like I can run a marathon and not get tired I don't know what it was um that last I'd say 10 hours was probably the most rough time for me because I was like you know what I'm, I'm I'm gonna be able to eat I'm gonna be able to eat so I wasn't hungry I was just looking forward to tasting something other than water and when it became that time to eat I wasn't even hungry. I told my wife, I'm like, I'm not, I'm not even hungry. And I broke my fast with bone broth. I believe you made it with- uh, Chicken and uh, carrots. Baked chicken, turkey breast. It's, chicken uh, breast. It was grilled. grilled. Or not grilled, it was uh, boiled almost, like shredded chicken. And uh, carrot. Yep. And it was extremely good. I had a nice good sized bowl of that and I felt extremely full after that. Now for me, from starting off from that Monday at 3.52 to that Thursday when I got weighed in till back to Tuesday when I finished all of this, um, I lost 32 pounds, believe it or not. So I'm at 3.20 even. Been weighing myself every day. You shouldn't really watch the scale, but I just wanna see how it fluctuates. And I'm still at that 320 mark. 
and I'm back. I went right back in to my 24 split. So now today is Friday again. I don't think I'm gonna do the prolonged uh, fast again, but I can't say for sure because I work long hours over the weekend. So if I'm busy and I don't get hungry, then I'm just not gonna eat. I'm gonna let my body dictate itself for this weekend. So, and just a real short way of saying it, my wife lost about anywhere between 10 and 15 pounds. I've lost 32, but I contribute that to the prolonged fast because I lost about 20 pounds during that. And I'm eating better, I feel better. I mean, life just seems completely different. Not only, is it right here, did we turn? Yeah. Not only am I eating better and I feel better and have more energy and eating more healthier and all that, we're saving money. Yeah. Those of you that follow us know that we love to go out to eat and that's one thing we wanna do right now, but we're not. And it's not even because we're hungry, because we're together, it's something we enjoy doing. But every time we go out, it's anywhere between you know, 30 and 50 bucks just for us. When we get our kids, it can be as much as 100 bucks. We haven't been out to eat at all. We haven't spent any money besides bills. Um, so life has been pretty different. Plus I've started school, so I'm going to school now in my middays. Um, but for those of you out there, there's the, uh, I'm not saying that everybody that is for everybody, but it fits our lifestyle because we're both hard workers. We're always at work. We're always trying to do something. So for us, it fits our lifestyle. It's saving us money. We're feeling better. We're, 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 uh, we're losing weight. So it's hitting everything that we want to do for our DC challenge, which what we told you guys that we were going to do and we're handling it way better than what we thought we would. And this is only the beginning. Like I said, it's only, a, it's only been a week or two. I mean, we have so much more year, year to go. Um, we did measure our stomachs. Uh, I haven't yet. What, you haven't measured yours yet? Mm -mm. Oh, we gotta wait. Oh, to damn. It, I, we I told you to do it that day. I was trying, but I couldn't get it. We'll do it as soon as we get home. As long as we My wife time. probably lost some inches and don't even know it. I thought she weighed, uh, measured herself, but she didn't, but I'll, I'll get it done today. I did measure my stomach, my thighs, my arms. Look at this guy. Look, look, stupid. Look, about to hit the buggy too. Stupid, stupid. Man, there's so many messed up drivers out here, y'all. Be careful when you're driving around. Man, that was just a stupid move to do. He just, he just shooting between cars. They didn't even look. They didn't even wait, like go up like, oh my bad, nothing. Just, just. Are we about to go into Walmart? I know there's a lot of food smells in there. What up, people? I just came out of Walmart. I'm probably gonna insert this somewhere uh, in the video here. So uh, I've got to tell you guys exactly pretty much what I've been eating. What my first meal always consists of is carrots, lean chicken, lean white chicken. Uh, I was eating broccoli here and there, uh, string beans. And uh, that's pretty much it. So it's just broccoli, string beans, carrots, and lean chicken. Always been my first meal through this little first two weeks that we've been doing this, week, week and a half so far. Um, as far as my first meal, that's how I break my fast. My only difference was when I did my 96 hours, I, I broke it with bone broth with lean chicken and carrot. Uh, what about you, man? I just been doing um, lean chicken with vegetables, carrots, broccoli, and string beans. Um, and then after that, I'll just eat whatever I want if I even eat anything else because I get so full from that. Sometimes I won't even eat right away, and um, I'll end up at work before I eat anything. Same with me for the second meal. It's been you know, what literally whatever I want. My wife weighed have made homemade steak and cheese subs, which I usually eat three or four subs. I know it sounds like a lot, but that's how I normally eat. I'm only eating pretty much half the sub. Um, usually when she make homemade burgers, when she make the burgers at home, she make double burgers. I usually go through maybe eight to 12 patties, no joke. But since I've been doing this, I've been eating like two patties, if that, and I'm done. So. My second meal has been pretty much what I want, what, what, what my wife cooks for the second meal, but I haven't been pretty much eating too much of it at all 
because I've just been so full. Um, on two of the days, I did have a chocolate cinnamon pop tart. Brown sugar. Cinnamon. Brown sugar. I'm sorry. Is that chocolate? I don't think so. I think it's brown sugar. Brown sugar. I'm sorry. Brown sugar, pop tart. I'm two of the days because I really wanted some sweet. Um, and that's been this, you know, in this two week period when I lost all the weight and all that. Um, other than that, everything's been good. Just water. I haven't been drinking anything else. No juices, no teas. Literally. I have hot tea every now and then. You have hot tea? But for me, it's just been just plain old water. Um, and that's, that's, that's pretty much it in, in, in a nutshell. Um, right? Yeah, I think so. I think that's everything. I feel it in my hands that I'm losing weight. My ring doesn't fit properly anymore. Your like, what? My ring that you gave me. Yeah. It doesn't fit correctly. I have to like, because it's cracked right here, I have to push it together. So you know it's what? overlapping. So it's I know my, my waist, I, uh, I've i been going lower on the belt and, still, and my pants are still coming down. Mm -hmm. Um, we will be remeasuring ourselves after a month. Uh, other than that, that's pretty much everything in a nutshell. So let's get back to it. But anyway, appreciate you guys watching. We love y'all watching. We want you guys to keep following us. Uh, we're going to keep pushing hard. And hopefully we can inspire some of you out there to not only save money, not only get out and enjoy your life, but to lose weight, go for your dreams, and do what you love, man. Because you are the creator of your own book. You can write your own story. But hopefully this helped y'all out. Down below, leave a comment. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and, and that notification bell. Remember, new episodes every single Tuesday. I'm working on music. There's more stuff to come. But until next time, I love y'all, man. Peace. Y'all already know it's your boy Rizzy. 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 Rizzy.